this is Victor. I'm here with a new battle report. 1,500 points. Arlequins versus Thousand Sons. We are going to play a match game, a random mission in match game using the um, uh, the chapter approved um, match play rules. Okay. So you remember the supplement that was launched after launching the rule um, Indomitus was from I think last August, something like that. They roll a small book that was for match play with some missions, but we are going to take a mission random from that book. Um, I'm going to play Arlequins this time and change my Sisters of Battle by Arlequins. I wanted to do a change and see and uh, try to play another type of army. So I'm going to play a battalion of the Bailed Path and really testing. So this is really for me a testing game uh, to see how the Arlequins are performing. So I'm going to play with three Shadow Seers. I want to test the different powers. And I want to use the Veiled Path to be able to deep strike one of these Shadow Seers uh, using the Warlord trait. Uh, the same Warlord trait will allow me to um, have to use the Deep Strike um, stratagem two times, right? Twice. So this reason I will put um, four units of troops, two of five, one of six, and one of nine. One of the units of five will have four um, Inferno Pistols and I will have different Inferno Pistols on the other ones. And this unit of five, together with the unit of six, they will go also in Deep Strike. And I want to use this as a, a spear um, attack of, uh, uh, yeah, the, the, this they the really the, to be able to attack to go into the enemy as fast as possible. I will use in the elite here. We are going to give, uh, have a death jester and two death jesters. Okay, one will have this um, the relic to be able to have a much better shooting, and then I will have a solitaire. the The objective of the death and um, jester, the death jester, sorry, and the solitaire will be to assassinate as fast as I can enemy characters if I can't do that. Then the, the Jester, uh, the normal one, is just to have some shooting support and try to do some damage on enemy units. Fast attack, two units of Sky Weavers, one with the Highware and the other one with the Catapult Cannons and the uh, Glaives, okay, the Glaives. Um, the, the objective of these two units is to try, try to go as fast as possible against the enemy, uh, use the shooting as a support and also to um, um, try to put uh, to be in close combat to minimize the shooting back. I hope I don't fail on the because my objective is to go as fast as possible against the enemy. Heavy support, one boy weaver, and then I will have one transport with uh, one star weaver that will uh, take the other unit of five players and uh, most likely one shadow seed inside. So the point is, the only ones that will go walking really will be the Death Jester, Solitaire, one Shadow Seed and, and nine players, the other ones will move quite fast. The, the idea here is try to move as fast as possible to the enemy and use the Death Jesters to hold any objective that is in my, on my battle, on my side of the battlefield, and maybe also use the Void Weaver, so they are going to be the ones that will be at the back, trying to give some support. My opponent is going to use Thousand Sons, so you see it's a very classical match in the wet way. The Thousand Sons trying to find the Black Library. Will they find it? And we will see in the future. So we have in HQ the Exalted Sorcerer on, on the Exalted Sorcerer on disc. I'm a Demon Prince. Uh, three units of Thousand Sons, two of five of one of ten, a Hellroot, five Terminators, and the Chaos Contentor Dreadnought with the Bull Kite, I think, cannons, I don't know, Reapers or something like that. So they want that really have a, a very heavy shooting uh, Dreadnought. And as a patrol, a Demon Prince, I'm 15 cultists. The cultist mainly is just uh, to hold objective. Okay, so this is all. What um, what we have um, for uh, about the armies, and now we are going to pass to the deployment. Uh, you will see now. I'm going to make it. Uh, you will see the armies a little bit close up, so you will see the miniatures, the attachment and mission, and we will start the battle. So here we are mustering the armies. Here we have the Harlequin army. So one unit of um, bikes. Here we have one unit of um, players. Second unit of five players there. The big unit of nine players. Another unit of bikes. The solitaire. And here we have the C, the three shadow spheres. Okay, you can see.
the two death gestures. Then we have here the vehicles. Okay, and then we have here the uh, thousand sons. So the cultists, the demon prince. So we have some still in progress. Another demon prince. And here we have one of the hell roots, the stench hell root. Here we have the warlord, the exalted sorcerer, the terminators, then the two units, one unit of ten, and then another unit of five. So here we have, and this is going to be the battle scenario. Okay, the mission we are going to play is priority target and this will be the deployment so we are going to do all the deployment we are going to put the armies on the table and I will be back for uh, turn 1 so beginning of the turn 1 so you can see how the battlefield looks like with all the armies uh, put on top okay so you see seems that Trench has been here before so we have finalized the deployment in that flank I have one unit of sky weavers, the star weaver with one unit of five on a shell seed inside, the solitaire and the two death jesters, void weaver, the two, uh, the other unit of uh, sky weavers, and then the big unit of players with another shell seed. And here we have the deployment zone, so the cultists, and then here we have thousand zones, the and uh, Terminator here at the back together with the Warlord so he's really, he's really protecting the Warlord because I, I didn't know what to secondary take and I wanted to take the Assassinate but this, he's putting this heart to me and then here we Assassinate or the cut off, cut the head off and here we have another unit so uh, the objective here it is uh, here we have another one, this is the, my pr pr uh, primordial objective or principal and here we have another objective and here under this guy we have the principal objective from the uh, thousand sons and there is another objective there so we go now to roll the turn so let's see who goes first so we're rolling it's a six and a four so uh, Harlequin will decide to go first no, you go first always now ah, okay, so Harlequin will go first yeah. so we are here at the end of the turn one of the Harlequins, I advance with the jet bikes here, shooting, I kill two of these thousand sons. You have to roll the leadership or not? What is your leadership? Eight, no. Eight plus two, no, you cannot fail here. And here I also did some shooting, killing a couple of cultists and I think three of these guys, so two of these guys here. And I put uh, four wounds on the Demon Prince. So that's all. It was a little bit too far to to um, to do a charge this turn. So let's see how goes. How I receive all the attacks, and then we will go to the turn. Well, no, we go to the turn one for the thousand sons. Okay, we are at the end of the turn one of the thousand sons. So here, um, yeah, they just went in combat. They do. They did um, three wounds in one bike in the close combat, but that's all. And then I kill one rubik marine. But the important thing is that the Rubik Marines are controlling these objectives. Here, the Terminators were teleported in the secret phase, killing um, one of my death jesters. And in this side is where we have the most damage. So all the shooting and together with the psychic powers, they kill first the psychic powers kill the bikes, and then in the shooting they kill the the unit of uh, nine players. And there they put one wound on one on the Star Weaver and. Five wounds on the white weaver, so he's surviving with just one wound. So we now go to the turn two of the Harlequins, but quite a good damage from the Thousand Sons. So we are at the end of the turn two of the Harlequins. So starting from my deployment zone, I bring the reinforcements into to deal with the Terminators, killing them all. Okay, between the shooting and the close combat, I kill them all. Here. Uh, my bikes were wiped out by the Demon Prince. Uh, I, I tried to, to charge on the Demon Prince after killing the, the Thousand Sons unit. Then the Demon Prince just killed them before I was able to, st to strike because he interrupted my, my turn. 
Here, the Shadow series with the uh, with these guys, with the cultists, uh, he received two wounds. And in this position, the Solitaire killed the Demon Prince. And then in the close combat, I lost three players and I killed some more um, Thousand Sons. So we go now to the turn um, two. two of the Thousand Sons. I score because I have my main objective control there. And I score because I'm in all front. So now we go to the turn two of the Thousand Sons to see how this evolves. The end of the turn two of the Thousand Sons. So he teleported these guys that were there to here, so exposing my solitaire on the remaining players, killing them all with the, in the shooting phase, between shooting and magic. This guy advanced, tried to kill my shadow seer, failing. Uh, and then this guy charged on my harlequins there behind the barricade, killing three of them, and he received two wounds in retaliation. Um, no more to say here. So the, these guys tried to escape and I, cons I did an heroic intervention of six inches to get in combat again. So we go now to the turn three for the Harlequins. So we are at the end of the turn three of the Harlequins. It has been quite a bad turn. So here I did not manage to kill the Demon Prince. I put him down to four wounds but I did not manage to... to all, he saved all the Melta guns. And then here uh, I just lost in the close combat. So it went, it went back, because there I tried to kill as well the Hellbrute. He is down to three wounds only remaining, but I didn't manage to scratch the last wounds to him. So we go now to the turn three for the Thousand Swords, but this is looking quite grim now for the Harlequins. So we are here at the end of the battle. At the end, he wiped out all my units from the battlefield. It was expected. Once I have uh, failed uh, to kill the Dreadnought and the Demon Prince, then I was completely out of number. So he just teleported from there to here, this guy. This guy has been the MVP of the game. And, he, and this guy killed the two characters that I have here with the shooting. And then this guy killed the Harlequins. And this in close combat, we have not made the movement, but he moved more than necessary and kill the vehicle in the close combat. So this was the end of the battle. A good game for the Thousand Sons and it seems that the Thousand Sons are closer to the Black Library now. <laughs> so thanks a lot for watching and see you again later. Bye!